I am Anil Kumar. In this particular video, we will learn how to model a real life situation with the help of quadratic relations. The question here is, a rocket is launched from the height of 2 meters and reached maximum height of 50 meters at a horizontal distance of 20 meters. Determine the equation to model the path of the rocket. So let us sketch the path here and then we'll model. So what we are given here is height in meters with respect to distance in meters, right? Now it says rocket has launched from the height of 2 meters and reached a maximum height of 50 meters at a horizontal distance of 20 meters. So our assumption here is that it fall, follows parabolic path. Normally it is so, so that is our assumption. Okay, based on this, we can say, let this be the path of the rocket. Is it okay? So that becomes the path of the rocket. And we say, well, let this be the maximum. It doesn't look like, but anyway, let's say this is the maximum. And that is the starting point. So two meters from the ground, when distance is zero and when the distance is 20 meters it reaches a maximum height of 50. Let's call this to be the maximum height. Okay now we have to determine the equation to model this situation. So we can say that height of the rocket with distance, let me write d here sorry, with distance d, d is my variable independent and dependent is h is we'll use the vertex form let's say a times d let's write d at 20 which is minus 20 whole square maximum height is 50 maximum height is 50 okay so that is how we get our equation so let me rewrite this so we are saying height as a function of distance is a times any distance d minus 20 whole square plus 50. now the question is how do we get the value of a? We can always get the value of a from initial position, right? So we know that the initial position is launching point. When distance is 0, height is 2. So we can substitute this to find a. So height of 2 for distance of 0. So a times 0 minus 20 whole square plus 50. Now that gives you 2 equals to uh, 20 square is positive 400. So we get 400A plus 50. Bringing 50 to the left side gives us 2 minus 50 equals to 400A. And that is equals to, we can write here, 20 minus 50 is minus 48. And we can say A equals to minus 48 over 400. Do you see that? So minus 48 over 400. So we could simplify this uh, dividing by let's divide it. <coughs> so if you divide by 4 for example if you divide by 4 you get 12 and here you get 100 correct. Let me push the page a bit. And now both can be further divided by 4 giving us 4 times 3 and this is 25. So what we get here is minus, that is this minus, 3 over 25. So the value of a is minus 3 over 25. Substituting this value of a here, we can write h, the height with respect to distance as minus 3 over 25 d minus 20 whole square plus 50, correct? So that becomes the function which represents height of this rocket when launched from a height of 2 meters with maximum at a distance of 20, maximum of 50 meters. So I hope you understand and appreciate the steps. The idea is when we are given a maximum, start with the vertex form. So we started with the vertex form. Since we need, knew that the vertex is at 20, 50, right? And that helped us to 
find the solution and we also use the point 0 2 to get the value of a correct so I hope that helps how to solve such questions I am Anil Kumar feel free to share and subscribe my videos and if you have any comments post them thank you and all the best